All right, guys, we are back, and today we're going to have a little fun. We are going to ask Generative AI on Google to give us information on the spot Bitcoin ETF. But first, let's do a little experiment here. This is my Apple stock application. I hate it. I hate it. It's biased, all the articles. But anyway, Bitcoin USD, we're at 43,800. Schmackaroos. And if you look down, they have Apple News, which is weird. It's Apple News Plus, but it's a Wall Street Journal article. You click on it. So it says the crypto industry holds its breath. Holds its breath. Oh, my God. God, man, I don't know where they come up with this stuff. They hold its breath in anticipation of the first spot Bitcoin ETFs. If I click on it, watch this. Ruh row you have to subscribe to Apple News Plus. I will never subscribe. Guys, never subscribe to anything. Memberships are the are bad because what they do, they hope you forget you have a membership and you keep paying in perpetuity monthly, yearly on these memberships. Never do memberships. Financial pro advice tip number one. And number two is don't buy crap you don't need, which is a membership. So look at that. I can't even read the article. Oh no, it's protected behind a paywall and it's Wall Street Journal and Apple News both. They all want their pound of flesh. So if you go over to AI and you ask the same question, right? I took the headline, boom, I put it into my Google search bar. AI gave me the same content free that right here, the Wall Street Journal pretty much put in behind a paywall. So there you go, pro tip, you're welcome. All right, and basically they're just saying, hey, you know, the, uh, spot, the spot Bitcoin ETF, everyone's in anticipation of it, blah, blah, blah. Uh, they're they're saying it will likely approve it, and they're saying um, also that they feel the anticipation has already been factored into the current run up in price. I don't know. I don't know about that. Again, nobody knows. And as old Bitcoin Ben used to say, it could go up, it could go down, it could go sideways, it could do nothing at all. Nobody knows. If you believe in it, do it. Again, this is may may lead to mass adoption. It may lead to mass adoption of Bitcoin, where these uh, ETF funds have to gobble up lots of Bitcoin. Now, the uh, bad thing about this is it kind of gets away from self-custody, as part of the skeptics say. Who are these skeptics? I don't know. There are skeptics everywhere, right? I give a crap anymore. If you want to buy something, oh, here it is. Skeptics say right here. The circle, the green circle of truth. Skeptics say it is nearly out of room to run. Bum, bum, bum. All right, skeptics. That was four hours ago. And that's part of the AI thing. Look at that. And AI, here's AI too. I love AI. AI is very uh, litigious minded, uh, legal minded. This is not professional financial advice. Consulting a financial advisor about your particular circumstances is best. Thank you, generative AI. Thank you. Now, please don't become Skynet and wipe out the human race. Thank you. Remember me. I support you. Yay. Anyway, uh, basically, they're saying also um, with the ETFs, you're basically moving away from the power of crypto where it's self custody because now it's all through an ETF, which is owned, controlled by the Black Rocks. They run the world, they own the world, pretty much everything. And uh, Vanguard and uh, Fidelity, all these other, and oh, what's the other one? I forget. Kathy Wood's thing. She has an ETF, I think, out. Grayscale. Grayscale? Yeah. Anyway, that's all I wanted to point out is there's anticipation. Do you believe? Do you believe the viewer, the YouTuber, the YouTube viewer, the YouTube webs? Do you believe Bitcoin has room to grow once this little puppy gets approved? They're saying by January 10th. We are at January 6th. Boom. Wednesday is the 10th. Am I right? Public calendar math hard for me. I went to public school. So six, seven, Monday is eight. Tuesday is nine. Wednesday is the 10th. Woo. No more freaking holidays until Martin Luther King Day. So yeah, be sure to send out your cards accordingly. All right, let's see. We got Bitcoin. I don't know. I'm on the fence. I don't know what to do. Put more, put some more fiat into this puppy. And then again, I break my own rule. I'm, I just buy through Fidelities now. It's kind of archaic. You can buy just Bitcoin and ETH. And then when you buy it, they, you know, you say, you, say it's a 40,000, boom. When you put your buy owner in for a uh, thousand bucks, whatever, you're going to get it 
not at 40,000, you're going to get a 40,500. They tack it on. You know what I mean? They tack on the price, even though the current price is 40,000. You're not getting the best price. And uh, so now you bought it at, it's a 40K at the spot, the current spot price. Boom. And then you bought it at 40,500. Now you're down 500 immediately. It's, it's kind of a weird thing, man. And uh, you got to get used to that. Uh, I need. I forget how Coinbase works. I know they take their pound of flush to their fee, which is fine. Everyone wants a fee, and that's how people get rich is through fees and providing services. Like in the old days, uh, gold mining. The miners didn't get rich. The people that got rich were the ones that supplied the supplies, like the shovels, the wagons, the food, the tents, the donkeys, uh, the picks, all that crap. The miners never got money. They were the one digging holes like fools. The other dudes were selling them supplies, setting up stores. Boom. They're the ones who got rich. There. Life lesson. All right. That's all I got. Stupid video uh, in anticipation of spot coin, Bitcoin, spot Bitcoin ETF approval eve christmas eve for a spot bitcoin etf so get your gifts ready will this thing go up to 60k again we also have remember i keep telling you 4 30 4 30 uh, april 30th is around the time of the spa uh, the bitcoin having go to nice hash they have a countdown clock on the expected approximate bitcoin having time and it's uh it's interesting it's a whole ecosystem I don't think Bitcoin's going away, which is good. They tried to kill it and they maybe they want to try to commandeer this thing to control you, to control me. They want to push digital currency on us. JP Morgan has their own crypto. They hate Bitcoin. He's going to only criminals use it. But guess what? Criminals use cash too, dummy. And uh, but if you look at JP coin, JPM coin, it is written on the Ethereum platform. So keep an eye on that. So maybe once this spot bitcoin etf crap gets approved boom ethereum is next and morgan will be uh pushing that as well because they're all greedy and they want your money and they want to control you so keep your eye on that monetize you know take advantage of it play the game it's like when uh congress people buy stocks you have a way to find out which stocks they buy they have to report within 30 days and uh, you can find this there's a lot of sites out there just google it and you will find out what nancy pelosi has been buying Boom, she bought NVIDIA. I bought NVIDIA, but shot to the moon. It works. There you go, guys. Pro tips, not financial advice. As AI said, look at this. Let's read this together. This is not professional financial advice. I'm an idiot on YouTube, not even getting paid to do this, but I'm putting out uh, content just because it's fun. And I think we can all share our knowledge together. And multiple logs burn brighter. So what are you doing? Tell me, tell me the future. I want to know. I want to get wealthy because with wealth buys opportunity and freedom and I can help other people. But right now I can barely help myself. All right, I'm out. Go forth. Two great things and happy spot Bitcoin ETF Christmas Eve, folks. Happy Festivus.